from the Bob Mills Weather Center, the Oklahoma weather expert, Alan Crone. Well, it's not in every single spot right now, but we're going to have some snow pretty common here in the next couple of hours. It'll move out quickly. This is just mostly a morning event in northern Oklahoma. Southern Oklahoma, it'll be mid-morning and then ending early afternoon. 35 today, blustery. North winds at 15 to 20. And yes, we have changes right on the horizon. And when we get past a cold morning tomorrow, we're going to have sunshine tomorrow. Highs in the mid-40s. Some of our neighbors west of us will hit the 50-degree mark. Sunday is going to be breezy. We hit the 60s, and we do have some 70s in uh, the seven-day planner ahead of this. But we have to get through, of course, this system this morning. Travel advisory, winter weather advisory underway. Southern Kansas, that is until noon today. Our advisories are set to go until 6 o'clock. Part of northern Oklahoma could be taken out of the advisory earlier, maybe around noon, 1 o'clock. The southern areas, it'll stay for the entire afternoon, we think. So let me show you the, the snow bands that are developing, again, from Independence to Cedarville, back to Ponca City and Oklahoma City, right along 44. And this should thicken them up over the next hour, hour and a half. So we have some breaks in it right now. Here's what it looks like in Bartlesville. Again, moderate snow coming down. It's been that way for the last hour, and it's accumulating there in the uh, northern sections of Washington County. Uh, Tulsa. Now, snow is developing, but in these areas that you see these little pockets, drizzle is underway in some locations. With temperatures below freezing, that drizzle can freeze on contact and quickly cause a travel issue. So if you're out early this morning, and you have what appears to be a little bit of light rain or drizzle coming down, that can cause a slick spot. Very, very carefully uh, maneuver that. And then when it starts to snow, I mean, you'll be slowing down because you'll see that. So this could be a little deceiving early on this morning in some of these areas to where you don't have a lot of snow coming down, but you do have a little drizzle. Here's the timeline for Tulsa, 7 a.m. until about 9 to 10. That's the highest probability. Between 10 and 11, it starts to shut down and move out of northern Oklahoma. We will keep a low probability through the noon hour, but most of it should be finished here in the northern sections. Uh, the accumulation process haven't changed much, one to two inches. A uh, couple of spots would be near three, especially in the far eastern sections. Southeastern Oklahoma later today, part of Latimer LaFleur County might get a burst of some heavier snow. We put the temperature and the timeline together, 20s this morning, 28 at noon. We'll rebound later today, 35 around the metro in the afternoon. And I think the clouds will clear right around sunset, and that will mean a clear night with temperatures dropping. Uh, here's uh, Tim Crone. Now, is Tim out? Yeah. Tim uh, is uh, out this morning. This is exactly what we're talking about here. Tim, it looks like we have a little bit of drizzle, and that's causing some spots to really get slick here. Where are you at? Uh, Alan, I'm 169 north down right at Admiral. And this vehicle hits the uh, bridge, uh, immediately spun out, hit the wall, obviously, as you can see here, facing the opposite direction. I'm blocking the traffic now. OHP just pulled up, but I'm blocking traffic because the nose of his vehicle is still out in this inside lane. OH, I mean, uh, ODOT is out in force. I've seen them, but I think they might just start now uh, starting to uh, treat the bridges a little more because when I came across the bridge, I slid just trying to sli uh, slow down to help this guy here. But... He's uh, not injured, but uh, the vehicle is still out in the roadway. So just going to post just a harbinger of things to come this morning. Alan, back to you. Yeah, unfortunately, again, when, when we don't have the, the actual snow pellets coming down, and it's just this little drizzle of ice, it, it can be uh, highly deceiving that, okay, you're all right. But remember, you're below freezing. And uh, this could get slick quickly here. This is why we have the travel advisory underway. 26 right now. Winds are gusting, so we do have wind chill values in the teens. 25 in Broken Arrow, 26 in Bixby. These are current wind chill values into the teens. 15 is what it feels like in Catoosa. Temperatures, so everybody's below freezing this morning. Strong north winds and wind chill values, again, 10, 15, 17 degrees. So it's pretty cold. Here's the progression of this. Around 11 to noon, it should be moving out of the metro, but under way across southeastern Oklahoma and the temperatures later today notice the little rebound out to the west 36 in Stillwater 32 in McAllister 34 to 35 in Tulsa so we get through today we have an improving weather but we are tracking a couple of systems there's one Monday night that provides a thunderstorm in southeastern Oklahoma 75 on Wednesday tests western Oklahoma on Wednesday hits 80 degrees and then we have another system on Thursday use some caution this morning we're right at the very beginning stage of this winter system system.